to see Georgia for this private cooking experience with my wonderful instructor, Luca. Okay. Hey, he's handsome too. All right, so Luca, what are we making tonight? Uh, today we're gonna make uh, Kinkali. Kinkali. And also, it's going to like the two traditional dishes from Georgia. Okay, two traditional dishes. So just like any other time I'm traveling, I wanna bring you some of those things that you can have here. And what better way than to try it myself? So by myself. So you ready to get started? Let's start. All right, let's begin. So first step, we're gonna make what? We're gonna make pastry for hachapuri. All right, we're gonna make the pastry for hachapuri. So we'll use uh, high quality flour. Okay. Here we have 175 gram of uh, flour. 175 then grams. We have to add just one spoon of yeast. Okay. <laughs> this is the yeast. Yeah. Oh. Okay. One of these. Uh, yeah. But we also need 150 ml of water. Okay. Water. But not this yeast. That so one. <laughs> Which one? <laughs> Oh, that one. so the small. So what is this? How much is this? Yes, one, one spoon of yeast. One spoon in, in the water. water. That's enough? Yeah, that's okay. Like that? Ooh. Then one spoon of sugar. Same spoon? So, okay. One spoon of sugar? Sure. And two spoon of oil. It's just sunflower oil. Sunflower oil. oil? Okay. Can you use like olive oil? Mm, no. Just sunflower no, oil. Okay. Yeah, now you have to mix it. Now I mix this. Oh my gosh. Now we have to mix it. With this? Yep. And then you can use the gloves. Uh huh. Or with your hand. Okay. So I'm mixing or I'll it. Oh, cool. yes, y'all. I'm just messing up. Luca is so nice. Like, you don't know. Like, I had a <laughs> challenge today, like earlier, and he set up a different time for me to come and do this private. Um, cooking class, so I really appreciate you. Georgians are great, so just... So yes, use it. Okay, everything. So I'm just mixing it together. All right, so after I mix it, do we have to let it sit for a while? Sure, yeah, maybe 20, 25 minutes, no more. We have to close by plastic. That's, oh, that's does it rise mm -hmm. then? Okay, so 20, 25 minutes. Okay, that's all. Okay, yeah. it's sticky, it's done. Yeah, it's yeah. sticky. Now we need to add two or spoon of oil uh, more. Okay. Yes. Two in here. Yeah, yep. Yeah, and mix it. Okay. Kala? So, that's all, I think. Okay. You don't need the gloves. Mm. So I'll take it and close it. All right. So that was step one. Yeah, that was step one. And then when you come back, what are we gonna do? We're gonna do uh, meat for kinkale. Oh, meat for kinkale. So I'm eating a lot by myself. <laughs> I'm excited, Luca. Okay. I can't wait. All right. So I had to get Luca to sit down with me, you all, because I want y'all to see him and interact. So next is step two. And step what are we two, making? We'll make it uh, meat for kinkale. Oh, the meat for kinkali. 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 I'm gonna get it. Kinkali. All right. So this is beef. Sure. That's okay. uh, so uh, we have to add the onion. Okay. All of this. All of it. Mm -hmm. yeah. I love it. Then we have to use this one. Okay. Ooh, this is like a tablespoon. A paprika. A little bit. Paprika. Oh, a, so it's, this is for spice. Paprika. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not big on it's spice. Too much. I think a little bit less. <laughs> that's enough. Yeah, that's enough. <laughs> and then okay. a half spoon of uh, a half cumin. Of cumin. This is what it's kind? a Georgian cumin, and we also know uh, Asian cumin. What the difference between? It's like the Georgian cumin is a little bit lighter than uh, Asian. Asian cumin is more uh, stronger. Okay. Because okay. we have to use uh, half a spoon. Okay. Okay. And just half spoon of the salt. All right. Okay. Is that enough? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Alright. That's well, my main ingredients. And I'm mixing it, and I'm gonna mix it down here, you all, because as last time, I made a mess. And I want to eat these. So, how often do you do these private classes? Uh, oh, every day. Just every, day. Every, day. every day by two, three times more, just really? more than once. For sure. Do you enjoy it? Yeah, you like cooking? Sure. <laughs> 
I need to get more words from him. But no. I don't know. He is. Okay, really that's all. Ooh. This looks like meatloaf. Have you ever seen meatloaf? Yeah, yeah sure. Okay. All right, so I'm finished with that. Okay, now we have to add the water. All right, so this is 150 grams of meat, sure. and we have to add in the same amount of yeah, water. Yeah, water. Yeah. All right, so this is not 150 grams. <laughs> okay. Okay. Just enough to like fill it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, why are we adding what you said? About the juices? Yeah. This is the maple? Yeah. So you'll see. Yeah, I think it's a little bit more. A little bit more. Okay. Hmm. And if you want, just you can try a little bit. Of raw meat. Yeah. <laughs> or just a little bit if you want. <laughs> what am I tasting for? Because <laughs> you have to, you know, uh, uh, maybe we need to add more salt, for example, or more cumin. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not salt. That's good. Okay. No, no, no. It's, it's, okay. it's, it's, it's enough. Okay. Okay. I think it's really good. Because it's your I love your it. <laughs> I love it. It's juicy, too. It's juicy. Yeah. So how to understand it. Like, okay. The water is going inside. Yes. That's mean that it's enough. Okay. So it's cold. And and this is it. Yeah, this is it. That's okay. all. Now uh the meat meat maybe will also 10 minutes to mm -hmm. say and then we can start. We'll okay, so the meat will set aside for 10 minutes. Yeah, 10 minutes. Or right. just right. the meat to, to just to settle. I get it, yeah. like just to let it soak in, like marinate. We call for it example, marinate. For example, for example. Okay, something like that. Okay. All right. Next step? Yay! Okay, okay. perfect. Where's the Okay, look at my. This is me, and this is Lucas. Okay. Now. Oh, you're gonna let me try it. Alright, the hen collie is done and it is steaming and the juices are there. So it's really hot. So I'm gonna just wait. I'm gonna put it to the side. And while we do that, we're moving to like step number five, so I think. Step number five is step three and four. Plastic. Yes. Plastic. Okay. Then we need to open it. So this was now, step one. I made this step one. Step one. So you put some flour on there. Yeah. So we're just about to make the shape of this. Okay. All right, Chris. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I can do this. Okay. Add in the flour. Yeah. And what kind of cheese is this? So we have the uh, two uh, different type of cheese. Mm -hmm. It's like suluguni, like mozzarella, and goat cheese, like goat cheese. The name <laughs> Emiratian cheese. So, <laughs> and if you want to make hachapuri uh, at home, you can use, uh, you can change for you know, suluguni, you can use mozzarella, and for Emiratian, you can use just a goat cheese. Okay, mozzarella yeah. and goat cheese, we yeah. can buy that. And also 50% of suluguni, 50% of mozzarella. Half and half. half, and half. I love that math. 50%. Yeah, Go, all the math teacher. Just need to add oh, all of it. Not all of oh. it. Okay, I'll say. Okay, just put it. Yeah, just only in the center. Only in the center. Ooh, that's a lot of cheese. So now 
Oh, we, we lose uh, the cheese everywhere. We need to make it a big thing time. So, how? Let's take it. Oh, Chris, yeah. damn. Like that. Oh, like a ball. Yeah. <laughs> that would help me. <laughs> so, then it will be better if you will turn it. Okay. And, I'll put it and put some more flour. And continue to. And now we need to add a small turkey in the left hand Oh, it's a hole. Yeah. It's an for open, a hole for the air. That's all. Mm -hmm. So, also have that. I told y'all. You have to add into the cheese here. It's like a double cheese, I always said it. Yep, you said the inside and the top. Inside and outside. Yeah. And just put it in here. Yeah. Woo! Okay. Thank you. And now mix. Yay! Think about whipping eggs, okay? Mm -hmm. This is really nice. Okay. Now you need to add everywhere without the circle. So around the circle yeah. and just spread it. I'll do like scoops and then spread. Ooh, Melanie is doing it. You got Mel doing this. This is perfect. I know I did. Good. Awesome. Yeah. Perfect. This is like a, like a hot food. I have said to you. <laughs> it's what it is. Boom. Okay, now we have time to eat your pink Ooh. And we have to bake it. Okay. Okay. So while this is baking. So it's baking like uh, uh, mm. uh, 13 to 15 minutes. 13 to 15 minutes. So and this is. 220 water to Mm-hmm. Okay. This. So before you go, tell me how to, to eat this. Turn. Flip it over. Yeah, you have to cut it. Like then just take a bite. Juice. And drink the juice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah. It's and okay to slurp. You say that. <laughs> and now just eat. Mmm. <laughs> 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 yeah. It's so good. So, did you like it? I love it. So, by yourself. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm. Thank you, Luca. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> We're ready. Ooh, your this looks nice. I'm just like, this is nice. Woo. That's your one. That's your I made one. that. <laughs> I made that with the help of Luca. But they... And we also use the butter. Okay. When you take it, you have to... Just put it in yeah. Yes, I love butter. Okay. So, enjoy your meal. So, eat it with this? Or we are eating by hand. <laughs> if you want, you can use a pork knife also. Which one do you suggest? Uh, by hand also. Okay. So, we'll start with that. So, just pull it apart. Yeah. Just take it. Did you like it? This is my first time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, so good. Mm -hmm. Bread is my favorite thing. Mm. <laughs> we did really well. Which one is better for you, for example? Holly <sighs> seems like it could be a little bit healthier. It's just that meat. This seems like a lot more with the cheese, but they have their own like wonderful taste. Sure. Like it's Excellent. different. Yeah. So. I think this is the end of the episode, okay? Because Luca has done a great job tonight. I really appreciate everything he's done. He has taught me so much. Now I'm gonna have to be calling him to help me because y'all can see what I can and can't do. But remember, if I can do it, you can do it. So thank you, Luca. Thank you so much. Sublicity, Georgia, anytime you're here, I'm definitely going to be tagging St. Funny. That's a wonderful name. Come and try whatever they have in all of these wines. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe because you never know when you got mail. Thank you. Go march. Go march. Go march. Let's go.